guys. You need to stay in your own fucking lane. Stay in your own fucking lane. What had me thinking about this is I just went to the grocery store and before I went, I was thinking about picking up some stuff, you know, following some recipes so that I could like regurgitate that to my audience and, you know, get more views and just put up some content that way. And I'm like, fuck that. I'm sick of doing that shit. You know, I did a little bit of recipes in the past. I might continue to do them here and there. But for the most part, I eat the same shit, okay? I think, I'm not even gonna get into the whole nutritional part of fitness, but I think it's so overblown because I think it's just follow the basics and you don't always have to have great tasting food. You know, sometimes you just thug it out and just eat some, some food. I mean, it shouldn't taste like ass, but it should, um, it shouldn't always taste like fucking, you know, God fucking put it on the plate. Okay, so what that had me thinking about was like, I'm just gonna do my own thing. I'm gonna stay in my own fucking lane when it comes to posting content. I'm not gonna try and do the same exact shit as everybody else. I'm just gonna try and live my life the way it is and document it, and that will be my fucking content, okay? And I think this is a very basic thing, but I think this is something all you guys can learn something from is to stay in your own fucking lane. You don't always gotta be out, you don't gotta be out here doing this stuff. You don't gotta be out here popping bottles at the club if that's not what you wanna do. You don't gotta be out here going out if that's not what you wanna do. If it's, if it's destroying your mental health or if it's destroying your pockets, you don't need to be doing that stuff. You don't need to be working a desk job if you don't want to. You don't need to be you don't need to be acting like a certain type of person if you don't want to act like that person. You don't got to be following other people's orders. See, that's a big thing. That's a big reason a lot of you guys are not happy right now because you're doing something that somebody else told you to do. You're not doing what the fuck you want to do. You're doing something that somebody else told you to do or that society told you to do or that is implied that somebody told you to do. I'm not saying somebody told you it fucking directly. I'm saying it was implied or it was cast upon you. We're told to do these things and we just assume that doing those things is what's gonna get us to where we wanna be. We think that, you think that doing what somebody else told you to do, you think that doing what your parents told you to do, go to college, get a good job, and you find yourself in that position and you're still not happy and you don't know why. I fucking know why. Because you're doing something that somebody else told you to do. You think that being respectful to people and you think that being nice, working hard, doing good in school, and working a job that some that your parents told you to get, you think that's gonna get you to where you wanna be in life? Fuck no. No, it's fucking not. Ask yourself, do you really wanna go down that route? Maybe some of you do. But a lot of you don't wanna go down that route. Your priorities and your desires do not line up with your lifestyle. So why the fuck are you doing these things? You think that being nice, being respectful, and following orders is what's gonna get you to where you wanna be? Fuck no. A lot of you guys, I think, are just, you know, caught in the matrix. You're caught doing shit that other people told you to do. You're caught in these norms that we're told are good. And you can't even make your own independent choices. And you're a fucking man, you're 22, 23 years old, and you can't even make your own fucking choices. Grow the fuck up. 
You don't want to be in that situation. Get the fuck out. Being, being nice all the time, being respectful, following orders. Doing good in school. Doing what your parents told you to do. Doing what your teachers told you to do. You think all those things are gonna make you happy? Fuck no! Cause that's not what you wanna do. You're a man, make up your own fucking mind. Decide what the fuck you want to do and determine how the fuck to get there. You guys are following orders. And you think that's what's going to make you happy. You think that's what's going to make you successful and that's what's going to get you to where you want to be. I mean, we're told these things. We're told go to school. We're told get a good job. You know, we're told to be nice to other people. And when you find out that shit doesn't even work, you feel disillusioned. And some of you guys haven't woke the fuck up to that. You haven't even fucking acknowledged it. You know it in the back of your head, but you won't acknowledge it. Or if you have acknowledged it, you don't think it's a priority now. You recognize that your job sucks and that you hate your job, but you haven't said, yeah, I'm gonna find out a way to do what the fuck I want and make money out of it. No, you say, well, oh, fuck man, my job sucks, but this is what you gotta do. No, it's not what the fuck you gotta do. You think your job gives a fuck about you? You're on payroll. They don't give a fuck about you. Wait till you fuck up. It's all business. They'll leave you out there on the fucking street if they need to. You are a subordinate. You don't think you are? You think you're their equal? You're not. You are a subordinate. You think they're not taking advantage of you? They are. I'm not telling you not to work a job. I'm telling you, you need to figure out what the fuck you want. And if what you want is not working the job, if you feel like you're ta being taken advantage of, if you feel like the job you're in is crushing your soul, then why the fuck are you still there? You don't acknowledge that other men don't respect you because you're not in shape. You're out of shape and you don't give a fuck. You, you don't acknowledge that other women don't like that shit. Your girlfriend doesn't like that shit. She's probably just putting up with you. She's probably waiting for other dudes. She's probably got a whole fucking line of them lined up. Because you're fat, you're out of shape, you're skinny. You're not taking care of yourself. And you just keep putting it off. You keep putting off the job decision. You keep putting it off the important health decisions. You keep putting off, go to the fucking gym. You keep putting it off because it's not a priority right now. Uh, well, I'll just let it slide, you know. My life is not horrible. Guess what? It's only going to get worse. Life is going to push you to a point where if you don't make the decision, you will be forced to make the fucking decision. It'll fucking kick you down until you address what it needs what until you address what needs to be addressed.
You don't need to be doing the same shit everybody else is doing. So what? You're not going to be accepted for it. People are going to talk shit about you. People are going to make fun of you. So what? Fuck them. You're going to be broke now because you quit your job and you went and did something that pays way less. But it's something that you like. And now you watch people disappear out of your life. So what? Fuck them. Fuck the money. You work now and you work hard. And you figure out a way to make more money with it. Every man should have the ability to sustain being alone. So what if those fucking people disappear out of your life? Because you decided to better yourself. So what? Fuck them. Every man should have the ability to sustain being alone. So what if you're not making as much money? Make it make money. Now you have a goal. Now you have something that you want and you're doing what you want to do. So now you don't have to go out and pop bottles just to keep yourself sane. You don't have to go out and drink every weekend just to keep yourself sane. Everything you do could be in accordance with this goal. Figure out what the fuck you want and make every action in accordance with that goal. That's what's going to give you a sense of purpose in your life. That's what's going to give you happiness. It's not hiding behind this facade. It's not hiding and following other people's fucking orders just to appease other people. Fuck them. I don't give a fuck who it is. I don't give a I don't give a fuck if it's your best friend. I don't give a fuck if it's your parents. I don't give a fuck if it's the fucking pastor. Fuck them. Only you know what's in your best interest. If that means you're going to piss some other people off, if that means you're not going to be making a lot of money and you got to sacrifice the life you're living now. You got to sacrifice the level of comfort you have now. So what? You're hiding behind this facade of comfort and it's going to kick you into the fucking ground. Life is going to fuck the shit out of you. Life is going to beat you down if you don't make the decision. You got to be decisive. Figure Right now, while you're watching this video, figure out what the fuck you want and be decisive. You know that thing in the back of your head? You know what it is. You know what you want to do. But you just, it's so put away that it's like, ah, I can't even do that. For me, that was lifting weights, starting a, a YouTube channel, being a personal trainer. It was like, ah, I want to have a YouTube channel, but it was like, ah, no, no, that's not what I really want. And I would tell myself that because it didn't seem realistic and it wasn't in accordance with what other people wanted. And I knew that if I quit my job and I had to sacrifice those things, I would be pissing some other people off. But guess what? Life forced me to make a fucking decision and I fucking chose it anyways. So you need to be de fucking decisive. Figure out what the fuck you want right now. Look me in the eyes. Figure out what the fuck you want. Decide it right now. Every action that you take should be in accordance with what you want. That's how you're going to give yourself a sense of purpose. That's how you're going to make yourself happy. It's not about anybody else. I don't give a fuck what you've been told. You need to do what's best for you. Fuck everybody else. Fuck everything else. Fuck what you've been told. Start dismantling all that shit. 
dismantle all those fucking limiting beliefs dismantle all the fucking shit you've been told and the the ways that you were raised dismantle it that shit's not how the world that's not how the world works Once you start acting in your own self-interest, regardless of what you've been told or what it's gonna, what the consequences might be, then you will find what the fuck life is about. You want a fucking six pack right now? Go out and get the fucking six pack. Eat right, sleep, work out. You want a fucking be a personal trainer go be a fucking personal trainer fuck your desk job that's gonna make your girlfriend dump you because you're not making any money fuck them that's gonna make your parents hate you fuck them it's gonna make your friends dip out of your life because now you can't do the same things as them and now you got different priorities as them fuck them fuck everybody you will find yourself I promise you that doing what you want and that is going to attract other people into your life that actually want to be there. That's going to make the connections that you actually want, not the people that are just lingering. Not the people that are there just for beneficial reasons and that take advantage of you. Fuck them. That's going to make other people hate. Fuck them. You need to get out of your current situation. Disassociate yourself from all that shit. Get away from the hate. Isolate yourself if you need to. Every man should have the capability to do that. That's the topic for the video today.